Hello and welcome to another episode of AA Computers and Technology. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to override this PAE error message in Ubuntu 14.04 and 12.04 as well. So let's get started. PAE stands for Physical Address Extension and if you really want to know more about it you can uh, go ahead and read up online. I know there's a couple really good Wikipedia articles on it um, but I'm not going to really go in depth um, into what it really is here. This is just how to get around it. I'm not going to explain it or anything because it's just going to take too long. Um, all you need to know really is that most Intel processors manufactured after the year 2000 do have PAE support built in. Um, the exceptions include the Pentium M processor and the Celeron M processor. Um, and as you can see, I have the uh, Celeron M processor inside this computer. If I can get that to focus, there you go. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to show you how to goodbye this little error message. So the nice thing is it actually tells you right here on the error screen how to get around this error message. Um, as you can see right here, it says PAE can potentially be enabled with the kernel parameter force PAE. Um, and I'm going to show you guys how to use that kernel parameter um, because it tells you that you can do it, but it doesn't necessarily explain how to do it. Um, so. That's exactly what I'm going to do. So obviously before we can do anything we need to get out of this error message so I'm going to go ahead and reboot this computer. And if anyone's curious the actual operating system that I'm using is xubuntu 14.04 which is basically just Ubuntu without Unity. Um, so I'm going to start the computer now. I have Xubuntu in my uh, DVD drive and then when you see the little man next to the keyboard at the bottom of the screen you're going to hit tab. All right, You're going to select a language, I'm assuming it's probably English. You're going to hit F6. You're going to hit escape. And then right here at the bottom of the screen you can see the line of text. You're going to scroll all the way to the right, which you should already be there, and you're going to type force PAE. That's F O R C E P A E. All one word. Um, let me go ahead and zoom in on that so you can see right there force PAE. And then all you're going to do is hit enter. And then um, Xubuntu should begin to boot into the live environment. Let's make sure it works. I'm just gonna zoom out. And you can see right here it says warning, forcing PAE. And there we go, that worked perfectly. That's going to be about it for this video. I hope this helped you. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, go ahead and post a comment in the comment section. Please do not forget to like this video, and of course, please do not forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. I'll see you guys in my next episode. Thanks for watching.